Okay guys, so before this tutorial starts, I want you to check out RaymondDigital.com. It's basically a website where you can get like really awesome high quality intro templates that are really easy to edit. All the info is in the description down below. <laughs> Alright guys, so as you can see right now, I am just like Carlo Cop says, he has, you know, since he has the, uh, the camera right there, he has the game recording right here. So basically, I'm going to show you guys how to edit like him. But first of all, guys, it is very important that you guys need to understand that you need footage first. So what I'm going to do now is, guys, I'm going to just complete this race and I'm going to just use this footage as well that I'm recording right now to edit that in Sony Vegas. So that's what I'm going to do because this video is being requested a lot. So basically, that's what I'm going to do. And guys, actually, in a few hours, I have also a video dropping how to edit like Jelly, you know, obviously with like the green line he has with the green screen and everything. Uh, all of that is coming up, guys. Make sure to stay tuned for that. And let's see how Quebble Cup edits. But before I can do that, I need footage actually. So that's what I'm going to do right now guys. Uh, so I'm going to show you guys how to edit like him, how to cut like him, uh, you know, like, like the orange face cam board that, that he uses and everything. So this is going to be epic. I'm going to make about three loops and I hope it's going to go well. I think it will. Let's go, Dio. And it's not that difficult to edit like him guys. You just need to cut on the right moments and, you know, have a fa orange face cam board that's always like his trademark and obviously uh, like scream like a lot. <laughs> so with that being said, let's just complete this race and let's st let's let me start using this footage um, to show you guys how to edit like him because it's requested a lot. I'm I'm trying to you know just show the pop-ups and comments because when I made a video on like how to edit like PewDiePie and how to edit like Scares, how to edit like Leafy and everything, everyone has been requesting Quibble Cop, so why not make a video? about how he edits because I'm very well known with the program Vegas Pro and I know how to do it so why not share my knowledge with you right now I'm just going to just keep getting those checkpoints and let me just finish this race so I can go ahead and jump straight into Vegas so I can show you guys how it's done then we'll be hopping into Vegas Pro so if this is going to take too long I will see you guys in just a minute when I finish this race so I have the footage so I can show you guys how it's done so let's go yo a few moments later and boom guys as you can see that is the race so i'm gonna go ahead and end off this video and i'm going to just jump straight into sony vegas it took me around three and a half minutes and let's go ahead and edit like quell cop all right guys so now that we're in sony vegas first of all we're gonna do is we want to make our video square and not like a rectangle fm pan crop this one and then we're gonna make this box a little bit smaller though we want to check mask then we're gonna go over and pick this you know this tool then we are going to just select a square around us as you can see right there not too many edges and as you can see right now we have a nice uh, image of us sitting right there so the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna make it smaller and we'll place it in the corner so we're gonna go over to this little icon which says track motion let's make it a little bit smaller and let's place it in the top left corner so I think he always does it like this or something. Boom. So now that we've done that, we're gonna add in and we're gonna add an orange face cam border. So now we're gonna add in an orange square image and we're gonna place that guy underneath. And we're gonna place this orange face cam border underneath our face cam. So we're gonna just place this guy right there and I'm just going to mess with it until it fits. So let me see and let me mess around until I work until it worked. So I'm just going to just try to position this right just like that. And then this one. And I'm just going to figure out until it completely fits the face cam border. It's going to be really simple. You want to just use event pan crop and you should be good to go. 328. AM. And boom guys, just a few moments later, I have an orange face cam border. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make this guy also stick onto the footage. So I'm gonna press, I'm gonna click on there, press control, control, left click, hold control, right click, group, and now we click on create new. And as you guys can see, I have an orange face cam border. This is how you add like Rebel Cup guys. It is that simple. So this is how it looks. Orange face cam border, gameplay right there. 
freaking awesome. That's how you do it. So you want to make sure that you cut on the right moments, like cut away silences, cut away arms, maybe cut away like crashes. So that's this video for you guys. Thank you guys for watching. That's how you add like bubble carpet. It's that simple. So if I want to thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for liking, thank you for subscribing, and I will see you guys actually in a few hours for a new video. How to add like jelly with like the green line in the corner and with like a transparent background, just like this one. So make sure to stay tuned, and I will see you guys in a few hours. So that's it for the video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to smash the like button down below and also subscribe button at the bottom. So thank you for the continued support. If you want to see more content, make sure to click right here. That's it for today. Thank you guys and I'll see you guys tomorrow.